hey, what's up, guys? This is Mylar on uh, Insecure Teen, and we got some great footage for you today. Uh, so check it out with me, and we'll uh, be sure to tell me what you think down there in the comment section. Oh, but uh, only write comments that I agree with here on the channel, otherwise I'm going to censor the crap out of you, okay? So anyway, let's get to our first video. Um, it's this like dude in Florida who totally caught this weird shit thing on his dash cam. And, uh, you know, I mean, I, it's like this blue light coming down out of the sky, you know, almost like one of those, um, um, you know, what do you call it? Like, uh, uh, meteors. Yeah, maybe. But of course this isn't a meteor, you know, cause NASA has already said, yeah, it was and everything, you know? So, and of course we know we can't trust them. You know, it's, it's, it's that science stuff. We don't need science. We've got the truth, right? All right. Hey, oh, by the way, stop by, uh, stop by the shop. We've got the new, you know, the new shirts there with the logo on it. It's really sweet. Check it out, man. Uh, thanks a lot. Okay. So, you know, back to the video, we totally see this, this blue thing coming down out of the heavens. And I mean, I, I mean, meteors just don't act like that. This thing's just coming like straight down in a great big ball of fire. And then it just vanishes right as it hits the ground, you know, like some sort of, you know, maybe portal opened up and, and, uh, you know, I mean, you can just kind of see it vanishing right out of you, you know, so I'm telling you meteors don't act that way, but you know, I'll let you make up your own minds. All right. Be sure to sound off in the comment section below with, uh, you know, your thoughts, but, uh, you know, keep them in agreement to, uh, the channel. Thanks. All right. Uh, next coming up, uh, we've got this really wild footage that one of our viewers sent us. Thank you very much. Fanboys of insecure teens. All right. Give a shout out. Yo, woo. All right. So anyway, uh, the dude was on a trip to, um, I think it was Vegas or Atlantic city or something. So anyway, he's filming out of his, uh, his plane window and he catches this UFO. Well, you know what? I'm just going to play the video and, and you know what? You guys see what you think. Yeah, yeah, I I know that I was gonna be quiet, but man, this part here just gets because you can like totally see, you know, like the clouds almost reflecting off the 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 hull of the ship. And you know what this reminds me of is those UFOs that 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 one dude Bob Lazar reported. You know, he worked at that S four place up in Nevada. Uh, you know, it really looks like those. And you know, that dude was like ahead of his time stuff with the, you know, undiscovered. Uh, uh, you know, element and stuff, you know, so maybe this is one of those craft that we're seeing. Uh, maybe this is some kind of a dark military thing, you know, who knows, but the, you know, the footage is interesting because I mean, you check it out and that UFO is just kind of, you know, like flying in like, Hey, I'm looking at you in the plane there. That's right. I know I'm being filmed. And then it's like, I'm out of here. And then it comes back one more time. It's like, and you know, it's, it's, it's like, it's almost like it's knowing that it's being recorded and it's just screwing with, you know, the, the, the dude. So anyway, you know, shout out to our homeboy fanboy for sending this into insecure team 10. And, uh, you know, so anyway, for the last cut, this is a real mind blower, man, straight out of that weird MUFON database, you know, that place where people actually go to report UFOs and stuff, you know, and don't do it on YouTube. I don't know why, you know, I mean, Hey, I'm always out there and we're, we're looking for your videos, you know, anything that we can you know, make a quick buck off. I mean, we'll give, give you a full link back to your channel and everything, you know, but don't expect any cash or anything. Uh, so, you know, anyway, Hey, be sure to leave your comment thought and section below down there. Yeah. Come on, man. You know, you want to. All right. Anyway, so this next piece of footage is, uh, is, you know, from this chick in, in Georgia and she's, and you know, or I'm sorry, it's a dude, you know, and, uh, I never get my facts straight anyway, but what the hell, it doesn't matter because you just believe anything that comes out of my mouth. So anyway, uh, this dude's in Georgia and he's like on his way back from work and he sees like this big black thing in the sky, you know, and, and it looks almost, you know, like a UFO. I mean, I'm not saying it's aliens, but it's definitely aliens. So anyway, here's what I think of that. Take, to take a look at it. Real quick. We'll take a look. We'll take a look. Aw, hell no. <laughs> Let's try this again.
Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. You're listening to PNT. I'm your host, reminding you that it's April Fool's Day. As such, can you just imagine what PNT would be like if that were our content? Now that you've experienced a horrifying moment of dread and existential angst, let's go ahead and run down the obvious. Number one, this is a meteor. Number two, this is a fake. We made it ourselves just to show you the kind of crap that other channels choose to shove down the throats of their viewers. We do things a little bit differently. With that in mind, let's get to this week's MUFON report. Today's report is drawn from the MUFON database and occurred in Conyers, Georgia. The footage appears to show a strange rectangular craft moving slowly over the city. Let's have a look at the footage.
So what was this strange rectangular object that was seen hovering over Conyers, Georgia? Rather than give you our analysis, let's switch the tables this time, faithful viewers. Based on the footage that you've just seen, we want you to sound off in the comment section below with what you think the most likeliest cause of this object is. We'll reveal the results next week. That's it for this time, faithful viewers. Be sure to click like, share, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to be notified when PNT presents your next portion of the paranormal. I'm your host, reminding you to keep an open mind, because a closed one shuts out the truth.